Hello, my name is Lynn Brown and I'm a consultant with Sims Independent. Today we'll be looking at how you can improve office efficiency using Sims Mail Merge. Let's take a look. The ability to run mail merge letters and labels directly from Sims can save hours of administrative time and also enable schools to send personalised information to parents, staff and other schools using a standard format. You can set up the template on your workstation to default to the headed paper for your school. We are going to set up a new mail merge. So if we go to reports and design, and then we will choose to create a new report using the student focus. On this occasion, we will look at the on-roll students, but we could select from inquiries, leavers, staff, etc. So now we click next and showing on the left is all the information that we can include in our mail merge letter. By double clicking we will select the full name, the surname and from the family home information, parental salutation and address block. We can now click next and choose our filter. On this occasion our select a registration group and click prompt at runtime to enable that facility. We click next and next again. We will choose to use the default of today as the effective date, but please know that by ticking this supply effective date at runtime, you could choose an earlier date and send letters to students who were previously on roll. So for example, to invite last year's year 11 back for prize giving. By clicking next, we now have the output options available and we will select mail merge and new as we are creating a new letter. We'll select just one registration group and OK. We now have a blank page with all the word functionality and can begin to compose our letter. If we start by inserting the time and date and ensure that the update automatically box is ticked and then we can use the letter again at a later date and the date will always be correct. If we go back to mailings and drop down the insert merge field. We can see that all the things we chose in our original report are now available for inclusion in our letter which we can begin to write. If we select address block and parental salutation we can then go to preview to check our finished letter and if we're happy with that we can click finish and merge to send to print. If you wish to save the letter, we can click save in Word and then from within Sims, we can choose save as and give the template a recognizable name for future use. We've used mail merge to create a letter to send to all the students in one registration group, but you could select any group of students including user-defined ones such as members of an after-school club and you can also use the mail merge functionality to create labels. If you've enjoyed watching this video and would like to get every new video delivered directly to your inbox, make sure you sign up to Aspire, our monthly e-newsletter. You can sign up by visiting our website. Thank you for watching.